In this video we're going to talk about Koi Koi, one of my favourite games, but I don't know how to play, but the basics of it are you <laughs> get eight cards in the middle to start off with, someone goes first, you have a selection of cards in your hand, you'll see that the cards highlight some of the other cards in the middle if they are able to pair off with them. There are loads of different hands, so you've got a little square button there for hands if you want to research the hands, if you want. Personally, I just pick random ones, pretty much. I know there's like, bear, bear, deer, butterfly. I know there's cherry blossom viewing. I know there's, you know, certain ones. Variety. So variety, I guess, is... I don't know what variety is. But if you call Koi, basically it means you're going to continue the game. If you don't call Koi, that's the end of the game. So I've got rainy four lights there. That's a really good start. You can get double points there, oh, 16 points is really high, and I'm considering continuing, but I thought against it because 16 points against like a, a legendary enemy or veteran enemy or what an expert enemy uh, is, yeah, is what it is. So the little red tags, uh, if you get four of them, you get a point. If you get four purple ones, you get three points, I think. Um, but yeah, it basically just mix and match the cards. If you get 10 of one set at the bottom right hand side, so if that number goes to 10, you get a junk hand. Uh, but usually, like, you get a proper hand before that. So yeah, it's just basically pair off the cards and hope you get lucky. For me, that's how I played it. I don't know the specifics of the hands, which is uh, unfortunate. But again, there's the cherry blossom viewing, don't really know how that happened. Magic, but we'll take it. That's another five points. So that's 21 points, is it? Yeah, don't call Koi. Take the five points. Because I think you get 200 points per point. So, uh, yeah. So that'll be... I'm on 4,200 points now. Unless he wins. Uh, and then that'll take it down a little bit. But, yeah. It's, it's basically just a pairing off exercise. If you're having any specific trouble, obviously look at the hands. You might be able to formulate actually how to play the game and make quick hands rather than, you know, random luck, as I would put it. But yeah, a lot of the time an expert, the opponent just rinses through hands, gets like junk hands, and then just starts building up points and different things. So, you need to get lucky. But yeah, any specific questions, let me know in the comments. I don't think, because he's 21 points behind, I don't think he's not going to call Koi. So you just keep playing. If he doesn't call Koi, then you're going to win. So there you go, Moon Viewing will take it. Really good hands. Oh, and there you go, absolutely smashed it. Absolutely smashed it. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please take care. And uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. 4,300 times 200. 8,600. Easy life. Peace out.